we're doing a, a little introduction. So uh, welcome everybody to, to, this, um, to this session, uh, live painting session with uh, Chess Fari. And uh, a warm welcome as well to you, Chess. It's a great honor for, for us to have you as our brand ambassador today, uh, painting uh, for us, for, for all of you who've joined. And um, I mean, Thank special you. times require, uh, require special um, uh, new technology allows us uh, to be uh, to be virtually connected, and I'm I'm really looking forward to that session, and we'll give over the the voice to you. Um, looking forward to the to the next hour of of painting magic uh, with you, Tusk. Uh, you have the word. Um, and wish you all of uh, all of you a lot of joy and fun listening and viewing uh, chess. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's a great, great honor for me to be here with you. Thank you all the people who is connected in this moment I, for for losing the time. And I try to to teach my my pine system with uh, easy concepts. Why, why is Minke? Um, and I think uh, I, I try to uh, explain about my color choice with a very, very direct and easy system. And after um, I show a little video, two minutes more or less for, 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 show my, my works for uh, explain also another concepts related with uh, the colors and the last uh, time in this uh, little meet, uh, I try to find something for you just for test, not a, a great, great uh, watercolor, just for test uh, uh, the colors and my, my, my way in, in this in this complicated uh, technique. Well, for me, um, why why uh, why is Mink? Is Mink is, is some 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 personal uh, choice, some personal way, because when when I started my my architectural uh, studies in the 91, 92, I started to paint watercolor with a Mink. I remember the first my first metal box is some 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 personal things are are involved, but after uh, with the time, I, I I found that the colors are very very intensive, the colors are brilliant, and I like very much that the, um, more than sixty six percent do of the color cards colors are monopigmented. This is very important for me for teach to my students the difference uh, mix of colors and, and other concepts I like very much. Today I prepared some uh, some uh, schemes for show my uh, my personal choice. I go to small my face is in this moment is not important. Okay, here. Okay, good. We have uh, we have uh, uh, my choice of colors with uh, metal box and uh, dot card. I, I, I show in the right screen, and I would like. Um, um, discuss about my my things, and normally um, I try to uh, um, choose two temperatures for primary colors, and after include uh, some personal colors. Okay, this is a, a natural way for equilibrate the the palette, and for example, I. I I have the blues. I post the blues. The blue. We have the 
cold blue and the warm blue, okay? And I prepared some warm blue. It's included in my palette. It's ultramarine, okay? Another warm blue is, uh, is a very, very nice blue. Is the endotron blue or in, in his main key words, Delft blue. This is amazing blue. I'm going to show something like this. Okay. It's very important. Uh, why? Normally two temperatures for color, but I like very much the, the blue. I have uh, four different uh, colors. For the cold, I propose the Helio Cerulean, very nice. And I propose the Aftalo Blue. Okay. We have four blues. And more or less, in, in depends of the every every theme, we can choose the different mixes for find the best solution, but I, I like very much um, play with four blues, okay? After we have the yellows. Obviously, obviously I have a cold yellow, yellow for example, yellow. Oh. Okay. We have a cold yellow with a, a warm yellow. The cold yellow, I propose the lemon yellow. Attention. Bon, là, il parle des couleurs. Je les connais. Okay. Je les ai toutes. And Je les ai toutes ces couleurs. The warm yellow, maybe. The chromium yellow. All colors are in uh, my dot card or my palette. It's are very, very interesting. Obviously, we have another transparent yellow. Okay, it's here. And with this, uh, for me, it's sufficient. Obviously, I can use the Naples yellow. It's not monopigmented, but I use, uh, uh, it's formed with uh, titanium white, a titanium yellow, and, and titanium gold ochre, but I like very much this kind of uh, pigment. In the, in the red point, more or less the primary red point, I use very much the geranium, okay. Yes, we're having yes. a lot of inquiries. Uh, chat function is, is, is glowing. Would you mind naming the colors and uh, saying the color number, which will help uh, everyone to, to allocate? Uh, yes. Uh, love to be precise with the numbers. So, <laughs> <laughs> just, uh, yes, yes. I'll, um, adding next to it, uh, the, the color. Um, number and uh, that would help a lot. Thank you. Yes, yes. We we, we have the the red in 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 case uh, three hundred forty one. The parallel marron is three hundred sixty six. Okay. Ultramarine finest four hundred ninety four four hundred eighty two four hundred seventy nine four hundred eighty four. 230, 215, and 657. This is the numbers of the, the Ashminke um, card. Obviously, Yeah. 
Bonjour, monsieur. Yes, you're muted. You, you got muted. Sorry. <laughs> it's okay? Yes. Thank you. Okay. As a as a call, he has a warm. Obviously, I, it's not in my in my dot card, but uh, I like very much the purpur magenta. The number of the pigment I think is pair one hundred twenty-two. Okay, as a as a primary, and obviously in. Between, we have our friend, our friend, cobalt violet. Okay, this is very, very, very interesting. The great work who can make with this color is our friend. Always is our friend. He obviously, in the in the zone of the greens. I don't like very much to use a lot of greens. Uh, normally, I I prefer to make, but uh, as a as a greens, as a greens, I uh, green. We have. It's very easy. Sorry, I I I, I think this is a school, <laughs> but I I I think this is a direct. Uh, way to show my my work in this case out of the circle i i have my special child after i have to talk about this and as a green i like very much to use a lot of turquoise okay we have the exterior of more or less the circle I used something like this, two temperatures for four mm -hmm. primaries, four, yeah. four uh, blues. And, in the, and I like very much the colors localized in the center. I don't like if I have a lot of a space here. The anthracite, this is a graphite. Obviously the, se the sepia is a color very nearest to black, but it's not black. I I met, met here, and the last color is the pinus gray. I use a lot of a pinus gray for uh, tonal values, etc. Sorry, I have a lot of a space. Uh, okay, and we finish this um, patchwork of colors. <laughs> Sorry. But I, I think it's very interesting that uh, we have two temperatures from uh, yellows with a transparent ochre also, four uh, blues with two, two temperatures, the greens and the uh, reds. This is very, very uh, important for me. Um, pine always with the complementary colors and apply with the different uh, mixed uh, solutions between the, the complementaries, uh, uh, um, for example, make the grays, not with uh, pinus gray or anthracite or sepia brown, no. Uh, play the grays with the complementary colors always uh, and give some different temperatures uh, for um, uh, make more ambience and not uh, uh, give a saturated uh, mixes, okay? But um, right now, after, I don't know if he, I can uh, put this uh, photo of, 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 of this patchwork, color, patchwork colors in my social areas, or I don't know exactly, uh, we can, we can uh, post after. Um, I, I would like to show um, some works just for uh, explain the last concepts. Okay. 
up. This is the skies. It's very important to, for me, um, play with the color, uh, but in the very, very equilibrated zones. This is a rainbow. It's very, very difficult for me uh, to find the rainbows, but I like very much the lights. The senses of the rainstorms uh, are very, very beautiful to try the different possibilities between the orange, the yellows, and the, the backgrounds of the skies with different blues, cerulean blues, uh, and aftalos, uh, etc. And other kinds of subjects are the underwaters. It's very, very interesting how the, the colors um, change with the deep. Uh, with more deep, we have a lot of uh, col colors, blues, and greens. I like very much um, the, the shadows and the lights inside the water are very, very interesting for me. Um, I, I think this is a good, good uh, theme and it's very necessary to know exactly the, the physical things and, and, and try to understand and find after. And obviously I like very much the, the beach, the, the sea, the uh, the waves, the form, the different games of colors inside. This is a very, very, it's a, a, as in a new universe, I like very much. The, the, and always in the, in the sea landscapes, I have my, uh, my color, the, 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 the ocean gray. Is is uh, is my is my friend. I designed it uh, with the sminke. Uh, how represent the um, um, the color of the sea? Um, this last color uh, is um, three pigmented. Uh, I, I I think is a great job because uh, I'll I'll I'll. Sorry, okay. A lot of situations uh, in the seascapes have three colors, the turquoise, the pinus gray, and the ultramarine. Make something with this uh, or, or black. We have a green gray, perfect to represent the, the seascapes. I'm very, very, very satisfied of, of this uh, product and uh, you can find this, uh, this gray, ocean gray in my metal box. Um, I think it's the moment to, to work a little bit. Uh, I try. This, is the, this is the color, yeah? this is the ocean gray. It's a very nice, very nice uh, gray. I recommend for, for pine sea and maybe it's the best for, for introducing other colors, but uh, only with this color, we can paint a lot of waters, a lot of waters, okay? Good. Uh, just, just for try a little bit, I, I put uh, some paper here. You have some questions, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Okay. There are a lot of questions, Chesk, but... Okay. Uh, if you want to, after my demo, we can discuss uh, about the questions or... Yeah, so we, we're all gathering the questions. I mean, we're, we're on the chat um, and we will gather the important questions and, and we'll do a lot uh, or we'll do a little Q&A uh, at the very end. Okay, okay. Well, I go to to make some beach uh, view, just the sky and 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 sea. I go to readjust a little bit my camera. Okay, just something like this. 
it's perfect. I put uh, water in my for the sky zone. I go to make the sky sand with uh, wet and wet language. I utilize a mop, and after I go to put a little bit of uh, yellow ochre near to the horizon for warm the the limit after with uh, a little bit of ultramarine maybe or a little bit of aftalo I can okay I we can make something like this I show my sorry okay you have here my palette. <laughs> you can and uh, we can see my difference. I try to my summer storm day. For the out oh, the part superior superior part of the sky, the colors are deeper. I'm very nearest to the horizon. We can use more cerulean blue. It's important. A lot of water. I try to make the clowns shadows with uh, ultramarine blue, a little bit of carmine, a little bit of burnt sienna, just for uh, warm grace. It's amazing. The clones, the nearest clones are warmer. And uh, the far clones are colder. Obviously, I have only three, four minutes for work wet and wet. It's very necessary to work with speed I never use the granulate colors for the sky normally I like very much the granulate colors you have the opportunity to to know the new granulated colors uh, from Asminke but for the sky I, I use just uh, transparent and not granulate colors. I don't like the texture in the sky. I put some cold shadows. Normally, I like very much to find the colors on the paper, never in the palette. Okay, it's very nice to see how the color mixing directly. I use a lot of uh, cobalt violet. For the first far 
elements. I try to, okay, it's good. The clones, the far clones are smaller. Are and go to finish near the horizon. I would like to give um, more presence in the nearest clones. I try to go. I mean, in the last water time, it's very dangerous. to reduce the water level for now open the pigment. Okay. This is uh, another kind of some little clones are situated here. And go to finish. And the last is the horizon clones. Okay, I think it's sufficient. I go to dry. Okay. You listen? Yes? We have some sky. It's not a, a, a very hard sky, it's just for in place some clowns and to create some summer one day. I have to make some waves here. The grays with uh, just present to the form shadows. And 
I go to use my ocean gray. It's fantastic to show to show that there are different colors and I want to make the waveform with the background. I will use the ocean gray also. Very important, no loss, the humidity time. Probably more present. To saturate this, I like very much the these light points with the dry system. It's very necessary to give this kind of uh, music for no show the same always. Okay, this is the, the first fun I want to give. I use a little bit of uh, finest gray. Cobalt violet. Yes, for okay. Colors are very, very transparent. And brilliant, I like very much. And go to the, the coarse noise. This is the foam game. I like the different situations of dark and lighter zones. to give the details front of us maybe more warmer not a lot just a 
Christ. I think it's very important to show something for the for thing for uh, for play, not not explain how. Um, this is a, a poem game situation. The the rest uh, every person who who see like uh, this word can think difference. Sintonies or games. I go to dry. So Okay, I go to make the horizon. It's normally it's darker or we have more deep and uh, with the deep the color change obviously. I use a lot The same gray. In this moment, with more ultramarine. And we can put have some different form games here I like very much and we can um, redraw a little bit of, uh, of the superior uh, wave. I'm going to finish with just uh, some shadows or bushes.
the rest. It's a fast track to show some of my work. Okay. It's a summer day, just for can grab some fast waves and try to I leave a little bit of uh, pigments are situated in the horizon line to create, we can create this, this effect uh, more soft than the first line. Okay, I think it's, uh, it's good. We can see here. Okay, it's good. Just a track, and I hope you like it. Thank you very much. Jesk, really uh, thank you for for this presentation. I mean, uh, we we've got a lot of feedback in our chat, and would like to address that um, in a minute. But uh, just a couple of words from Schminke. Um, we highly appreciate that, and thank you. Seeing you painting uh, and seeing the enthusiasm you have within your paint, which is just amazing. Thank you, and for thank all you. of you who've been asking, um, which color is it? Where, where can I get them? Uh, Chask has it on set, which is uh, which every retailer in the entire world could get. Uh, besides that, um, for example, in Spain, as many from from Spain are are, are joining, it's available at Atomiranda, uh, a, a good customer in uh, in Spain. Yes. So just forward that to um, to, uh, to Arte Miranda or any other retailer of your trust. Um, another topic I would like to, to address is your ocean gray. Uh, <laughs> it's, a, it's a fabulous color we've been uh, developing together. 
And uh, for all of you who've been asking whether it is available as an individual tube or pen, we uh, we're surely um, uh, in in discussion with uh, with Jesk, um to to have it as an individual color uh, later this year. Uh, but this is. Uh, this will be later this year, and we will discuss it jointly with Chesk, as he is the owner of this uh, this precious <laughs> uh, precious color. I I hope I hope that the Ocean Grey uh, to be alone. But uh, a lot of people ask me, I can, I want the Ocean Grey a lot, but it's, it's perfect to paint the sea and obviously uh, for the moment it's only in the metal box, but. Uh, we, we are working together for to make some very, very interesting about this. I mean, watercolor is something uh, really fast. I mean, this sketch just took you 15 minutes, which is impressive. Um, Thank you. But uh, the yield of, of the colors uh, is, is long lasting. So um, we are looking forward to, to being in touch with you, Chask, and um, I would like to uh, ask you some more questions which uh, which been arising. Um, for example, which paper you've been using? In in this case, I use it the the watercolor paper from Hanemule. It's a three hundred uh, cotton paper. Um, I like very much uh, this kind of paper where we have uh, a lot of possibilities to. Uh, to leave the, the color, um, to resolve uh, a lot of uh, mixings on the surface. And this kind of paper uh, give me one, two minutes more than another papers uh, in the wet time. I, it's, it's very important, but, uh, for example, uh, for to make this kind of skies, uh, I have three, four, five minutes, and uh, this system is the same for a little uh, a little cheat or a, a, a complex um i like it very much thank you uh another question um which been uh been quite frequently asked once again could you name and uh, especially the numbers of the colors uh you've been using um especially for, for your sky. That's been a, been a question which has been asked quite frequently. So the order of your numbers and uh, the name of the number. Um, and okay. I, um, just I, I, I give you up. the name. I give you the name for no, for no explaining a lot of the, yeah. the numbers, the people lose, the concepts, etc. Normally, the, I, I make the skies with the background. And the color of the high background, uh, normally uh, I use the cerulean blue with ultramarine blue or uh, del blue. I descend to the horizon and take the cerulean blue. Okay, um, ultramarine is PV29. The, the del blue is uh, PV16 uh, and the cerulean blue is 15.1. Exactly, but 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 the, the solution is is give the different temperatures in the height position after for to make the shadows of the for the make the clone shadows. I use normally the PV twenty one, the ultramarine blue, or have with a, a laser in carmine or the or, um, purple magenta, the PR one hundred twenty two. I don't know, and a little bit of uh, brown sienna, and for to make the longer shadows. I use uh, the the violet and a little bit of uh, ultramarine blue. It's, it's in this case. Uh, obviously, the, we have a lot of sky situations uh, in different times, different days, and different uh, uh, times. Of I mean, you you're painting now in in Spain, and uh, I mean, fortunately, the weather. Down there is uh, it's better than here, uh, rainy, uh, rainy and sometimes even snowy skies. Um, uh, I mean, the ocean gray would be better for, for painting uh, a German sky, but uh, 
Um, yes, the the the, the the ocean gray is is a uh, is, uh, very um, um, easy gray to work. Okay, but normally the water, uh, for example, I I use the the painless gray, the ultramarine on the on the and the turquoise, or um, I, we can change the turquoise for the Peridian. Um, every, uh, every beach, every ocean is different, obviously, but uh, for example, uh, the battleships are gray, is not blue. <laughs> In generally, the, the color of the sea is uh, Green gray, green gray, more or less, not exactly blue. Okay, um, uh, every every point of the sea, uh, in function of the deep, give us uh, different uh, colors. And obviously, the light of the day. For example, I try to show the sunny day with uh, a lot of uh, wine. For example, uh, this is the this is my my little sketch, okay? But uh, the, the, the ocean gray here is, is, is very important. I mean, it's, it's a unique color and it's you, you, your own color, which been formulated just by yourself. Um, so I, I personally love it. I'm, I'm not an artist myself, but uh, just by seeing the color by you or seeing you using that color, that gray color, I mean, it's a gray, which is, uh, which is super versatile, as, as you said, just by, by, by seeing it, I'm, 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 I want to paint with it. And uh, that's why I'm really happy to, to, to develop that even more and um, make it more available to an even broader uh, audience. And this will, will surely be, uh, be done this year. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, but the, the, just the, this, uh, this is meet, this meet is just for show, just for to present uh, my way on my in my opinion. What is the 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 choice for for finding in the plein air in the studio, etc. Every artist, every person have different possibilities, ways, and sensibilities to represent different. Uh, uh, subjects uh, are the still wife, uh, sea escapes, mountains, the snow, uh, skies, uh, portraits, etc. And obviously, it's not the same. We have a, um, a rigid uh, form for all. Uh, we need to test. We need to know. We need to understand some some physical concepts, obviously. But after uh, Schminke have the the, the possibility to give us uh, a very, very extended card and uh, give us the different possibilities for uh, working very, very easy. Just, just a question uh, from our side. What do you think of the super granulating colors which been launched uh, last year? You, you have them, you, you've painted with them. Uh, what do you think? Yes. I, I like very much the granulated pigments. Um, I think the, 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 the question is, uh, um, what can I do with these kind of pigments? Uh, what is the, the subjects? What is the zone in my watercolor that uh, I can use the, um, the granulated pigments for give uh, more detail, more texture, more uh, first uh, plane? Um, make the difference to the, the backgrounds or foregrounds. Um, personally, I use uh, more these kind of pigments for the earth, for the foregrounds, for the uh, trees, for example, but I don't use a lot in, in, in the skies in, in other subjects. But it's, it's, my, it's my personal choice. It's not, uh, obviously, it's not uh, in general uh, extended uh, for all, all artists. Right. Uh, thank you for that. And the special this year is that we have the super granulating colors as well in, in five milliliter tubes available as sets. So uh, I will just really briefly uh, show these little uh, precious cases to you. Um, this is, for example, the Galaxy set. Um, Amazing. With, 
marvelous uh, effects on the granulation. You have the deep sea. Um, you've been using that Cheska, I think, and um, as well the glaciers, uh, which are just astonishing uh, colors. Um, and uh, so these are available now at, at all retailers of, of your trust. So just feel free to, to, uh, to contact them. Um, and tomorrow, as a recommendation from our side as well, there will be uh, an artist live with Anna uh, from Russia. She will be doing uh, an entire presentation or a demo on those super granulating colors. Uh, if you would like to join, they are available on our Instagram page for you to, to join. Same format, um, same place tomorrow um, at, at lunchtime, German, um, German time. Uh, at, ah, at 11. Um, so just before lunchtime. Um, yeah. And um, so, Chesk, I really thank you uh, for, for this session. And um, I'm really much, uh, very much looking forward to seeing you back again. Um, hopefully soon in, in person. Um, may, may all of you uh, stay healthy, uh, you and your families, uh, with the Thank very you. best wishes from, from us here at, at Schminke. And Chesk, again, um, muchísimas gracias. Uh, as well from Susanne, yeah. and uh, Thanks, uh, we are really blessed by, by having you in, in our team. You're part of the Schminke family and uh, really looking forward to, to do a lot of more uh, stuff with you. And um, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot for you. It's, uh, it's really, really great to uh, make something together. You are a, a great, great team, um, great persons. And I hope uh, to meet you in person in, in another <laughs> times. We have a, a a special situation in this moment, but uh, sure will be uh, reconduced. And I hope that uh, um, kinds of meets uh, will be uh, in person and, and always, why not in, 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 the, in, the, in the social areas, but uh, um, I need uh, to be together with the people and, and work in, personally okay but this is another discussion and i would like give you the best the best for you the best for your families friends and i have uh, your disposal and uh, many thanks uh, to the people who who saw our demo all time and see you in another meet Help. Thank you, Chesk. And you, uh, to, to all of you, uh, stay healthy, uh, stay positive, and uh, enjoy painting with, uh, with Horam, with our Schminke colors, and really the best wishes uh, from us. Uh, stay you. safe, and see you all soon. See you. Thank you. Bye. Ciao. Bye. Bye-bye. Thank you.